hey guys welcome back to the channel I'm back again to do another wig review I know this is this is bold this is super super bold I had to get it I didn't see nobody else with this bad puppy and I just had I had to do it I had to do it it reminds me so much like a, a Beyonce style um, just by the color and, and the curls and stuff it's super long not real long but it's long and it's blonde and and it's dark up here as you can see and the color let me show you this um it's a lace front i just cut off the lace but that lace i don't man that lace was stiff as hell up here at the top if you can hear that mm -hmm. it, it's kind of stiff up there um her name is lita and it's by Altre. And it's a new it's um it's a new unit from what I understand. Okay. Um the color on the model is the DR613. But when I ordered mine, they didn't have that one. So I got the DR27613. And it's not I don't think it's really much difference from mine's for this one maybe it's the maybe the blonde is a little lighter so this one's more like um more like a honey blonde hers look more bleached that that probably would not work for me um i haven't combed it out yet the sides here or the tabs go up here now I mean that's the only thing I had to kind of cock it to the side and stuff. I don't know. Maybe you can work something out with your own hair, like on the sides, right here on the on the corners, your sideburns or whatever. Um, this puppy ain't going nowhere, and I say that because this is the first unit I've purchased out of all the units that I have that has a comb here, a comb here, a comb here, and pow, comb in the back. Mm. Yes, so I got them all fit in. So this this ain't going nowhere. Look at this. You know, I don't have this one. This side ain't very good, but and I have it like super super tight too, and that ain't good because I will get hit it. But I mean, look at this. I mean, the style of it is so cute. It is ridiculous. I've combed it out. I did get a little bit of shading when I took it out. So I don't know how it says it's heat safe too. I don't know if you saw that on the car, but it says it's heat safe. And it seems like it like the curls just bounce right back. Okay, so let's see this with the shading. Something like this it probably does. You know, quite a bit of shading. It does bounce back right back. Look at that. Now Okay, so you're gonna have some shedding with this with this unit. You're gonna have some shedding. I see that right now. You have blonde hairs wherever you go. You leave really blonde hairs behind. Um, but it is super cute though, and so I mean I wouldn't even really worry about it. When it's not something you're gonna wear like. all the time anyway so the shooting isn't gonna matter it's not real thin either so I don't think and so I'm assuming there there's I'm trying to look up in here y'all forgive me okay so let's check out the parting space excuse me if I'm not looking towards that way because I am in a mirror so and I can't really see all that way because my um, all that well from the camera because my camera sucks as you can see sometimes my videos be looking like what the hell um hold on wait a minute okay so that this is the uh, scalp up top and it looks like you probably get a good um you can get a good Hold on, let me make sure I don't want to 
So I'm gonna tell y'all wrong. Okay, so it pretty much stops. It pretty much stops right here. And see the hair is so dark up up top, but if you can see that's the parting space right there. And I do need to trim up the lace a little more because I know you can probably see it. I was just trying to hurry up because if I if it's not bright outside then everything looks blah. Um, so I'm just using my light over my bathroom. So there's the part in space. About as long. But I'll say probably two and a half. Two and a half, maybe three inches. Give or take. Part in space and then it stops. Then it goes into the cap right here after that. So all of this. So I'm assuming you could part here, so let's just check. Cause I hear it's kind of harsh right there. Ugh. Lord have mercy. Okay, hair just be everywhere. Um, you could do a little flip it to the side. You yeah, know, you can. This. This is the uh, false scalp there too. So it probably goes from from here, from here, to here. So to your to your temples. So that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'll show you using my other brush because this is ridiculous. Dog brush. It's not really a dog brush. I'm just, I'm just saying. Um, I like it. I don't really do colors like this, light, light colors, until the summertime. So, and I don't know if I want to wear long hair like this in the summertime. If it would probably be like a night out or something like that. Not for um all day things. Where I'm at in the summertime, it's well over a hundred degrees in the summer and I'm close to Palm Springs and it's even hotter over there in the summer so um okay so it does tangle a little bit <laughs> I think because of the curls but you know hopefully you're not gonna be like combing the hell out of it now with this like this, it kind of reminds me of Jessica Rabbit. Y'all know I love Jessica Rabbit. Right along with Marilyn. Okay, so. This is what it looks like. This is probably. Um. What I want to say. For his inches. Maybe like 18. About 18 inches long on me. And I'm like 5'2". So I don't know um, what the length will be. It might be a little shorter. Damn, shit's like hell. Sorry. <laughs> um, might be a little shorter on somebody who's, who's taller than me. But for me, on me, on my height, it's about 18 inches. So. I needed something else. Because these curls are so tight. Yeah, it is ridiculous. <sighs> I never have anything that's just where I could put my hands on it. I'm always searching for something. Oh well. Okay, so yeah. So it's a lace front by Altre. Eunice Colita says it's um it's um da, 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 heat resistant fiber, safe up to 400 degrees, of course. Um. And I got it from haircloset.com. Now, the unit when I paid when I got it, it was $29.99. So, and then they had um where you get 10% off. So that was like three dollars off of it. To the tens percent, two percent is only taxes and shit. So it was three dollars off. So I paid once they added the shipping, which was like Shipping for where I'm, where I'm at is like eleven dollars and thirty two cents, so it came to thirty eight dollars. 
I mean, that's not bad. I don't think it's bad. I mean, it's it's bold. I like it because it, it, it reminds me of uh, a Beyonce look. So, I mean, you could, you could probably pull this up. Because as you can see, here's the, there's pretty much the hairline. I need, like I said, I need to trim up the uh, lace a little more. So, I mean, you could... You could kind of get away with maybe pulling it up. And I mean, right here, like in this area, you can see it kind of looks a little red. When the light hits it. I think it's that 27. 27 and then up when it goes, it's, it's more like... Um, what else? What do I think? It's pretty much 27 throughout this area. And then it gets dark right up right in here in, the, in this area. So it looks like you would like you color your hair and then this is maybe your natural hair growing out or you know whatever. So and it goes all like that. The, all throughout the sides y'all might want to see the back so I'm gonna turn around I hope y'all can see it because I can't really see what y'all can see in the back. so that's what it looks like in the back and um yeah so let's see what all we can do with it you know I like versatility so it says you can you can um you can put heat to it. So I would say if you're gonna put heat to it, it's probably just gonna straighten it unless um you know you spritz it a little bit and then curl it. You know, there's always a method to that madness of having to um curl your heat resistant units is you know and it does shed, just so y'all know. It, it sheds, it sheds like a zip, zip, zip. Cause I got hair. Let me see. I got hair on my clothes right now. Pretty much, quite a bit of hair in this, in this brush, as you can see. Look at that. See, it's coming all out right here. So it does shed quite a bit. So if you purchase it and you're like, well, what the, what the hell? Look at this, you know, but I mean, you, you may get one that may not shed as much because every, every unit isn't the same, you know. I may got the, may got a kind of a whatever batch and then somebody else will order it and may get one that, get one that don't shed at all you know but i'm sure you could probably figure out something for that at all whatever so okay so the great thing about this is that you can you got a lot of parting space or quite a bit of parting space to work with and then right here in the temples like i said the scalp so you, you can part it on the side and you know kind of throw it over to the side and you don't have to worry about you know your cap showing okay so okay so I, this is how it looks on the side and I don't know about let's see because you know I told you there's combs in the back there's well one comb and then so it's quite a bit of hair in the back. They wasn't stingy with the tracks on that, so I have to say that much. They was not stingy with the, with the tracks. The cap is constructed really well. I like the cap. Um, like I said, I have it adjusted to the tightest, and it's probably not a good idea. And I need to cut the lace off some more because this looks just tacky. But. I don't know why I keep brushing it because it's just going to keep shading. So this is it. I just wanted to come here real quick. Forgive me for looking busted. But like I said, I hardly even get 
time to really do anything because I'm always working. Matter of fact, I had to work today, so I haven't been home that long. But I wanted to do this because I don't know when I'm going to have time to actually show y'all this. And I don't know if anybody who's um, who's checked it out was probably wondering but kind of hesitant about buying it because I'm daring. I'm daring and I don't care. I will buy something new or whatever. You know, I dare to be different and, you know, I don't have to have what everybody else has, but I will buy some for my own curiosity and share with others. So if it's, it's if it's a, some bullshit ass product, then y'all, y'all won't have to waste y'all money on it. For me, you know, I'll figure out something else to do with it or give it to my sissy or whatever. So, but this is real good. Look how, you know, I keep brushing that and then like push it forward. And then it has, it's kind of in layers too. So that is real cute. It's in layers. So yeah. So the, it, it had lace on it. And that lace, uh, I didn't bring it over here. That lace was hard. That shit was stiff. And I'm like, what the hell? It wasn't soft at all. So, and then the lace that I cut off is kind of, it should damn near give you a paper cut. So I need to figure out something for that too. And loosen it up a bit for I have a headache. But yep, this is it. I don't know what y'all think about it, but I like it. I like the color. I wish this was uh, human hair. That'd be great. But synthetic works. Synthetic works for you know if you just wanna throw on something uh, for a quick um, transition to something different. I mean that's cool. But, I mean, if this is human hair, you know, y'all can rock human hair a little. Y'all can uh, get more wear out of human hair than you can synthetic. A lot of my synthetic units I wear, like, for a few days and stuff. And that shit starts, it starts looking tacky and busted and shit. And I'm like, okay, well, I need to take this off and wash it and try to revive it. And all, you know, it, it's a lot of, um, it's a lot of care for your synthetics. A little more than... For your human hair, because you can wear your human hair for probably a good week or so before you have to really do anything to it, for as um washing it or whatever. But them synthetics, forget about it. You know. So yep, this is how it looks, and I'm gonna stand up so y'all can see. This is how it looks. And you can see that layer. So it's it's kind of short right there. Well, not short, but it's cute. Now tell me that this doesn't remind you of Beyonce. Not that I'm trying to look like her, but it's different, you know. Yeah, some people that take their 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 human hair and human hair units and you know and, and achieve this look, but you know if you can't afford you know you know you want a budget and stuff and you can't afford you know one of them um human hair units and stuff and and to get this look and stuff hey here's a synthetic that's pretty reasonable you know 20 something dollars and you know the taxes of course taxes always eat you up but i mean for 38 dollars might as well just round it out to 40 bucks i mean this is cool I'd have to say this is cool. I like it. Um, they could do something differently about the shedding and it tangles. The tangling is because of the curl pattern. That's all that tangling is about. It's not really meant for you to um you know comb all the damn time, but I would just twist it like this and I would keep it kind of let me show you. Kind of twist it like that. And then do that, and then you can just leave it, and then that way, so you don't have to be messing with it. And then this, you know, um, you know, you could just you could kind of play with this, the front. But you know, I don't know if you want it dangling down in your face. For me, I don't really like hair on my face, so you could do that to it. And I think that would conclude this review on Lita.
by outre. I mean, you can do, you can pull it back. You can pull this, pull it back. You can pull it up. You can probably take, take a clip and pull it up and pull it off. Cause I mean, if you have dark hair, cause right now my my hair is like jet jet black. So, but I do have a cap on underneath. So, um, you trim the lace real good. I mean, this will, this can almost pass for your own hair. I know that looks a little tacky, but I'm just trying to show y'all how, how it looks. Now, this is some of the lace that I said I gotta, I'll probably take my little scissors, which is basically these little scissors right here, and it comes in, in a sewing kit, and I'll probably take these and kind of trim up the edges there that I don't want unnecessary uh, lace. So, what the zippity? Okay, so yeah, maybe you take some spray or something. And I keep pulling up because it's too damn tight. So you can pull it up. You can probably pull the whole thing. Up. Now I wouldn't go so far as to pull it up on the sides because I told you the tabs right there come up kind of high. They don't go all the way down. Um, I kind of cocked it to the side or whatever, at least so that. Oh, uh, so your tabs are right here. That's not good, cause this is not where your your sideburns are. Your sideburns don't start up here. Your sideburns are right here. So that's up kind of hot. They could have did a little better with that. But other than that, this is a good little unit. Look, and then it just bounces back. You can. There. Yeah, this is, see, I'm just being silly now. <laughs> I'm being silly, but I mean, you can. Now I feel like one of the Williams brothers on White Chicks. Oh, Y'all remember that little scene? He was like, <laughs> anyway. Um, so look, yeah, there. And I mean, you could pull off that messy look too with this. That I just got out of bed look. And it still just goes back to its original state. Look at that. That's just ridiculous. You can do whatever to this shit. And it'll still just. It'll still look good. I just. I think I just made the hair a little bigger doing that. Well, I think I've held y'all up enough with this hair. Um, plus, my light is starting to look a little bullshit -ish. Um, So, this is the color. It's just a teeny bit different than hers. Like I said, I think the difference from this one and the one that I'm wearing is that the hair, the blonde hair is more bleached. As you can see, hers is different. Mine's is more of a honey, but hers is bleached. So I think that's the difference between hers and this one. But as you can see, all this up here is pretty much the same as, as, as the unit I'm wearing. And that one that she's wearing, like I said before, is the DR613. And mine's is the DR27613. So... The 613, I'm assuming, is the blonde. But it, they can't be 613. Because hers looks hers looks more bleached than mine's. Hers looks more bleached. And she looks like she still has the... the okay, well maybe she don't have the 27. Okay, they goofed up on that one. Because... Uh, It's dark up here, right? Right. Okay. The 27 is for all this area, pretty much around here, except for right here, because I said it's a little, a little darker. Okay. What the, what the freaking hell is hers? It, it's just not, it's not just the 613 by itself. If the 613 is referring to the bond, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. 
Um, some of all that don't seem right. I just not realize that. It's it, it can't be a DR just six thirteen. And what the hell is with the letters anyway? I don't. You know what? I'm not. I'm not even gonna go through that. So this is Lita color DR twenty seven six thirteen. Um. Comment. Let me know what y'all think about Lita. I did get her from um, Hair Closet. And the unit when I purchased it was $29. I think I think at the time it was on sale. I'm not sure. But, um, and it came by FedEx. So, if you order it, you should get it pretty quick versus... Um, using it by USPS. Um, with that, you probably pay a little more because they'll have the the three dollar taxes. Yeah, it'll probably be about forty bucks. Cause like I said, I got a ten percent discount. I'm not sure if um if that same deal is still going on that I I caught, but um. I'll leave the link below so that you can go over and check it out or maybe you could check some other um, sites out that might have her so far that's the only site that I saw that had this unit you know um, because it is new as far as I know so yeah that will conclude this review I'll leave the link below where Lita is and enjoy comment rate subscribe all right Bye, ladies.